There are numerous variations to the IVF cycle, to the in vitro fertilization, to the assisted reproduction protocol. Uh, perhaps during some, such as the natural cycle, you might be able to get pregnant naturally, but um, usually a part of the protocol is actually blocking the hormones of the woman so that the growing follicles with the ripening eggs would not rupture spontaneously. We need to prevent this from happening. You know, this is natural spontaneous ovulation so that we can actually uh, harvest the eggs during the oocyte pickup. And there are various medications that are applied, uh, some e e even prior to the stimulation, but usually it's during the stimulation which affect that. So during the stimulation itself, that would be uh, quite unlikely because we we uh, mix and uh, play a little with these hormones. But prior to the stimulation cycle, it's not unusual, especially with the uh, currently uh, actually uh, most uh, often used antagonist protocol, where the stimulation starts from day two of the cycle. And it happens every now and then that we prepare everything for the cycle, the protocol, the medications, and then wait for the menstruation. Sometimes the menstruation doesn't come. Sometimes the couple actually gets relaxed. They stop to try. They feel, okay, now we're in the hands of the physicians or of the specialists and let's just wait what happens. And sometimes this relaxed attitude leads to the spontaneous uh, fertilization or uh, conception.